Hey guys, welcome back to Ryan's TV. I'm Ryan Seno Go. So today I'm at Namba Station. As you can see, there are so many people because of the spring break. Even it's weekend though. Today, finally, I'm heading to the Kanidoraku, which is one of the most popular restaurants in Dotomori. So I'm so excited. Well, if you have visited Osaka, probably you know that Kanidoraku is a really popular restaurant. However, <laughs> I've never been there even though I was born and raised in Osaka. Yeah, so I definitely should visit there at least once. So that's the reason why. Let me show you guys how to get to the restaurant located at Dodomori Food Street. So firstly, you need to go to the Ebisubashi City Street, which is the white wine. By the way, there is a discounted ticket store over here. If you want to have a discounted ticket, you can buy it here. And this one as well, it's a discounted ticket store. Usually it's several hundred Japanese yen cheaper. Well, maybe you have heard it hundred times, but that's the Osaka's number one cheesecake, Rick Rhodes cheesecake. Yep, now there is a line. Rick Rhodes cheesecake, it's really soft. Only you can buy it in Osaka, so make sure if you visit Osaka, try it at least once. Usually, it's a really popular souvenir for Japanese as well. My Tokyo friend always asks me to buy the Rick Rose cheesecake whenever I go back to Tokyo. Yeah, that popular. So, get it. If you want to know how it looks like, please check this video. Oh my goodness, look at that. So many people. This street was like an empty street before. But now, yep, people are coming back to town. I think there are two reasons. The first reason, yes, it's spring break. The second reason, Mambo, which is kind of like a state of emergency was lifted. So, yep, people finally get back to the town. Oh, look at that. New Sanrio store is open. <laughs> there is a crow machine as well. And here we go, that's Ebisubashi Bridge. And the Dodonbori Food Street is just over there. It's really close. Wow, already so many people coming back to the Dodonbori Food Street. As you see, at the entrance, you find a big crab. Yes, that's the Kanidoraku. Oh, seems like many people there. I don't make a reservation. Hopefully I can enter though. Well, before enter the restaurant, let's check the Ebisubashi Bridge and the Dodonbori Food Street. <laughs> yeah. Wow, so many people. This is one of the most popular photo spots in Osaka. That's Greek Running Man. Usually people take photos with the same pose as he is. And it seems like this is a line to take a photo. Oh yeah. There is a line for the photo spot. And this is a street heading to the next station. Wow! <laughs> so many people coming back to the town. I'm happy to see that. It's Riverside Street. I visited here last month and it was like a ghost town. But now, finally, more people walking. Sweet. And now came back to Dotonbori Food Street. Oh, look at that! Lokujushunen Kanleki desu. It's been 60 years after they opened it. Wow, they have a long history. I didn't know that. In front of the restaurant, there is a stall, but it seems like it's all sold out. All right, let's go in there. You know, I've come over here over a thousand times, but it's my first time to enter. So let's go. Wow, inside the restaurant, there are so many crabs. Nice. All right, sweet. Let's go. Ah, this Wow, we can see the Ebisubashi Bridge and also Dotonbori River as well. That's Don Quixote. So I'm using this big table by myself. So those are the lunch menus. So the most reasonable one for the lunch 
this one, the 3,300 Japanese yen, which is about 30 US dollar. I think it's not that bad. Well, before, I was pretty sure that I would choose these. However, this year's gold. Let's try this. Let's do it. By the way, we can see the beautiful Ebisubashi Bridge. Actually, this restroom has up to the fourth floor, so you can see the beautiful view, but uh, <laughs> it's all packed. But you know, I could enter here without reservation, so I think lucky enough. <laughs> all right, the first food arrived. Look at that, how fancy it is. This is an appetizer. This is the crab, and also this one, it looks like a salad. Hmm. Let me try that. Itadakimasu. There is some dressing. And... Ah! Oh. Looks pretty good. Wow, look at that. It looks pretty nice. So, itadakimasu. Hmm. Mitchoshi. It's really nice dressing sourness plus the flavor of yuba, which is made by soybean. Hmm. Interesting. And also, this is not the junk food, so eating something healthy makes me feel good. Loving it. Well, you know, sometimes I see the comment that Ryan, don't go that cheap. Look at me. Well, definitely, we are going to the next level. Well, probably this year, travel ban will be lifted so that I can see you guys in Japan. Yeah, I'm really looking forward to it. Let's keep walking. <laughs> oh, look at this crab. It's already cut it so that we can eat it super easily. Nice. And here we go. Dip into the sauce. Itadakimasu. Mm. <laughs> you know, I really love the club flavor. Plus, I think this is kind of like a vinegar. The sourness perfectly matches with crab. Loving it. Well, when I was a student in the States, one of my hobby was going to the buffet, which has the crab. <laughs> and I tried to eat the crab as much as possible over there. However, usually that kind of crab, <laughs> we have to break it all the time. And <laughs> uh, there was many competition. So that's why I couldn't eat much. Maybe I was too weak. But uh, now, yes, I don't fight with anyone and <laughs> I can eat the crab safely. Loving it. Mm. Psycho. And here we go. The next food is crab sashimi. Interesting. It's my first time to try. Uh, there is a wasabi and soy sauce. Well, I didn't know that we could eat the crab in raw. Actually, it's not smelly at all and really tender. Really, really tender. And also, the taste is really sweet. It's kind of like similar taste when I eat the super nice uni. Mm, nice. Loving it. Well, it's kind of hard to take it off. Wait. Look at that. Actually, they have special chopsticks. Well, it's not the chopsticks, but uh, it's a crab eating tool made by wood. Uh, with this, I can take it off much easier. If you can't use the chopsticks, don't worry about it. Yep, this crab sashimi with wasabi, perfect. Well, in such a beautiful weekday, eating fancy crabs, <laughs> I love being a YouTuber. Love it. So the next food is shumai. Inside, it's a crab meat and some fish. And here, it's a karashi, which is a Japanese mustard. So, itadakimasu. 
美味しい。Well, it's totally different compared to the regular s h u m a i I think it tastes more like a c h a w a n m u s h i with crab and a seafood taste, though. And here we go, the next food comes. It's a gratin. Look at this tiny, cute size. Well, after this, we still have a hot pot tempura and the sushi, so, you know, this size is perfect, I believe. Ah, sorry, I'm sorry. Ah, they just gave me the new hot tea because the old one it gets kind of warm. Really nice service. <laughs> so, let me see how it looks like inside. So, let's open that. Are you guys ready? Three, two, one. <laughs> oh, sweet. <laughs> looks like regular gratin, though. Let me see. Hmm, smells pretty good. <laughs> oh my goodness, it's really hot, but it's good. Well, I have a nekojita, which is a cat down. That means I'm not really good at eating the hot food, but、uh, yeah, it's good. Inside, there is a small mushroom. Mushroom is one of my favorite f o o d However, in Japan, it's really expensive. When I first time visited to the States, I was surprised because the mushroom price was much cheaper compared to Japan. <laughs> yeah, so the mushroom was my favorite food when I was in the States. But after I came back, I haven't eaten the mushroom much because of the price. <laughs> Instead of the mushroom, we have a shiitake mushroom. Well, the flavor is totally different, but I love shiitake mushroom too, so. Hmm. Still acceptable. And here we go, the next food is crab tempura. Wow. Oh my goodness, look at this huge crab tempura. It looks like a lifesaver. <laughs> Maybe I can beat the dirt spider with this crab. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, he won't eat it though. If you think that's a fake crab, nope. Actually, you can see the crab meat all over the places. Okay, so. Yeah. As you can imagine, it's pretty good. <laughs> oh my goodness, I've been saying it's pretty good. Maybe I need to learn more vocabulary. <laughs> But all of them are it's pretty good. <laughs> And also, there are some other tempuras too. I think this is the bean. And I believe this is a sweet potato. Mm. I love sweet potato tempura. これも普通に入れちゃってしゃぶしゃぶみたいな感じでもそのまま食べるんですけどそれでもちょっと置いてからお野菜とか先に入れていただいてみんな白くなったら召し上がれますあわかりましたありがとうございます I had no idea how to eat it, and then she just told me. Firstly, I have to place the veggies. Yeah, again, it's my first time to eat. From next time, I know. And if even it's your first time, already you know too. <laughs> so let me place all the veggies. So she told me when the crab meat b e c o m e white color, it's time to eat. Is this good enough? It's okay, let me try. Alright, so I think this one is ready. Oh, it's hot. <laughs> oh, look at this. Wow. <laughs> Maybe it was not ready yet, so let me dip it a little bit more. And I think it's ready and it gets warmer, so I think it's good. 
Hmm, it's good. But I think I prefer the crab sashimi. Well, this hot pot is pretty good too. However, yeah, compared to other foods, uh, I think I prefer the sashimi one. It's good though. Tang, it smells hot pot here. <laughs> the hot pot is good, but it's too hot, so I wanted to make it separately. Yeah. This way, much easier to eat. Mm. Alright, so the next food is a cat handle crab sushi. And also, we have the miso soup here. Oh, looks pretty nice. Inside, I think it's miso and also the crab. So let's eat the sushi. You know, sushi with miso soup, it's always good. And speaking of the crab sushi, I usually eat imitation crab sushi, which is like a California roll. And then now I realize that, wow, imitation crab is doing a really good job. <laughs> of course, it tastes better, but uh, yeah, thinking of the price, for now, I prefer the imitation crab sushi. I like it though. Mm. Ooh. And the last, we have uh, ice cream. Well, speaking of the quantity, I think it's pretty good. Uh, you know, usually this kind of expensive restaurant, they have a good price, but really tiny quantity. However, yeah, as you see me, I'm full, definitely. And this is the last one. It's a matcha dessert. Wow, this one seems like they're using a real matcha. Mmm, bitter. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's right. That's how the matcha is supposed to be. Well, I definitely need to eat with the ice cream. So let me eat it with the ice cream. Mmm, yeah. The ice cream sweetness plus the matcha bitterness. Yes, that's how the matcha ice cream is supposed to be. Loving it. Oh, that's interesting. Actually, they gave me a lemon to wash my hands. So basically, uh, you use a hand when you eat the crab. So the finger has the fish smell so that I can use the lemon. And after that, here. Huh, interesting. And also, let me see how much it is. Oh, oh, I see. Actually, I thought that's not included tax, but it is included tax. So the price is 5,720 Japanese yen. Mm, not bad. <laughs> it is expensive though. Oof, that was pretty good. Thinking about the 6,000 Japanese yen, well, still, it's a lot of money. However, I definitely think it worth it. Yeah. So since we are at Dodonbori Food Street, let's go to check the takoyaki lines. And let's see if people are really coming back. So let's go. So it's 4.30 p.m. It's not the dinner time yet, but... Uh, oh, nice. There's a line for Juhachiban. Probably in the dinner time will be a longer line. And there is a line for Kushikatsu Daruma. <laughs> People are taking a photo with the angry man. And also Wanaka too. Oh, interesting. Odori Dako has the longer line. Well, I totally understand because this place it's more like photogenic. So for the young adults, this Odori Dako is more popular. And so is Creole. However, sadly, not so many people at Kinryu restaurant. Yeah, I think it's because this place is more popular for foreign travelers. Yeah. Oh, nice. They restart the 24 7 business. Sweet. By the way, it's a good news for travelers. Now we have a kura over here. So if you want to eat the cheap sushi at Dodonbori Food Street, 
Okay, go. As you see, the advertisement is in English. The probably the Kura is targeting for foreign travelers. However, due to the pandemic, still no foreign travelers coming to Japan yet. Yeah, feels really sorry. Now came to my favorite spot to see the sunset. Here, compared to that Ebisubashi street, much less people, and uh, the scenery is as beautiful as over there. It's a beautiful place, isn't it? Yes, it's my favorite place. Let me take an Instagram photo here. Oh, by the way, if you haven't, please don't forget to check my Instagram account as well. So, how about the whole Zenji Yokocho? Last time when I visited Hosenji Yokocho and the Hosenji Temple, there was pretty much no one. But I believe since people are coming back to the town, uh, someone is there and splashing the water to the Hosenji. Let's see. Seems like more people are coming back to the place. But this place is a really popular spot for foreign travelers, so still. Let's be boy. And now I'm at the Senichi Maesuji. This place is kind of like a gamble street. There are so many pachinko stores. Oh, since we are here, let's go to check the Doguyasuji too. Tool Street. Can you see that tiny street? That's the entrance of Doguyasuji. Oh, by the way, in front of Doguyasuji, there is a Don Quixote. They have a food, drink, alcohol with cheaper price. So if you are staying around Nambaria, you can come over here. Well, there are many different kinds of Don Quixote here though. But uh, I think closest to the station is that one over there. And here we go. We arrive to Doguyasuji. So Dogu meaning tool in Japanese. They sell many different kinds of tools for stores. Yes. <laughs> Even they have a huge beginning cat as well. I'm not sure this is on sale or not, but uh, yep, it's huge. Look at this store. They sell classic Japanese dishes and also the stuff for stores. <laughs> if you want to buy a big beginning cat, you can come over here. There is a hocho, which is the knife store. You can find many different kinds of Japanese knife. <laughs> well, you can find a really traditional Japanese knife as well. If you are crazy about takoyaki or taiyaki, which is a fish pancake, you can buy the tool here. Uh, let me see the price. Oh, I see. Those two plates with this base is 28,000. If you want to have an, another set, this one, this black one, is 38,000. Well, thinking about the stole material, it's not that expensive, huh? I thought it's more expensive. It is expensive though. And this taiyaki one, 160,000. Wow. And also, this is a futon and a noren store. That one called Noren. Interesting fact, someone who learned about accounting and finance, the goodwill is Noren in Japanese. Yes, coming the word from that, Noren. <laughs> Look at that, that's interesting. That's a discounted ticket store and <laughs> Spider-Man on top. <laughs> it's pretty random, but I like it. And now we came to the number parks. It's a big shopping mall, but there is a hiking trail in the shopping mall. And also, it's in south part of Namba area, so that compared to the other places, less people. So this is the Namba Park's hiking street. Under that, there are many stores. So it's like a park and a shopping mall. Starts from here. It's a really nice walking street. Oh, 
it's a little bit chilly. 13 degrees right now. Yes, Japan gets much warmer. However, still a little bit cold. But definitely springs are coming though. Speaking of these number parks, it's really beautiful. I was born and raised in Osaka. Every of my videos pretty much all about the Osaka area. If you haven't, please check that and you know about the Osaka more. Yeah, it's my hometown. <laughs> Even though I was born and raised in Osaka, it was my first time to go to Kanidoraku. And I know now that it's pretty good. Well, before that, I was thinking that's just an expensive place, but uh, no, I know it's a good place. So if you love crab and then you want to try different kinds of Japanese crab foods, maybe you can visit there. And yes, 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 we will try more and more new things and new adventures. So don't be shy. If you haven't, please subscribe. Big thank you to the Patreons, because of you guys' support, I can keep traveling. If you haven't, please don't forget to check my Patreon account. Arigato! Alright, so this video pretty much that's it. Hope you enjoy virtual travel to Japan through this video. So see you in the next video. Seno, <laughs> Have a great day. Bye-bye.